Here we have the Paladin, one of the other hybrids. And instead of summoning, um, he's got healing. And there's also she versions. My wife plays a female Paladin, she's a tank. This guy's set up in tank spec right now, which is called Protection. Um, but this is a little smug face. I just love that. That's what a Paladin should look like. Smug. I don't know. Three specs. Holy Paladin, Healing, Retribution Paladin, Two-Handed, Face Smasher, and then, of course, Protection, which is the tank. <coughs> um, you were saying damage dealing, so I'll just go ahead and show you. Dual spec system. I'll show you that. Again, not going into all the talents or anything, because that's about mastering your class. and We're not worried about that right now. And apparently I don't have a two-hander, but I can make one. So one second. Just to show you here. Maybe. This one. Yay. Now this is a very weak weapon. It's just an heirloom, but it's just to show you what's going on here. Summon Charger. Class-specific mount. Very nice. What level? Level 2 base. Well, then we'll just have to... I'm going to pause this and fly somewhere so you can actually see what they do. Did I do that right? I don't know if I did that right. Am I recording? Yes! Okay, so... <clears throat> the way this works is I decided to tell you about their dual... Uh, resource system. So you spend mana using your abilities to gain holy power <coughs> and then you use your holy power to do your, your big moves. Um, free heal, big hit, AoE hit this big, and so on and so forth. So kind of the opposite of a death knight, which makes sense because they're supposed to be opposites. But the difference is, is um, <coughs> you have to manage both resources on a death knight and on the paladin mana basically is free and you have no worry or concerns about it whatsoever so I'm not gonna say that the Death Knight's more complex because the Paladin has other things that they need to do that makes them you know equally complex I guess um, none of the classes are really overly hard anymore I think the most busy classes are the healers and the tanks at the moment but uh, <clears throat> yeah so it's just different it's not easier or worse or anything else but they bring about heals. That's their, their hybrid. They do casting, so they do caster damage, but it's all through melee strikes in this case. And healing, which we have some AoE healing, but not that much. Uh, they do have quite a few ranged abilities, though. Oh, this is a low level. Ignore those numbers. Um, they're fake. <coughs> I'm hitting a low level dummy, so I do bonus damage. It doesn't count. But basically, you just see how I've got Holy Power building up over in the top left corner. As soon as you get three, that opens up Final Verdict, which is your big hit. Um, of course, they all look big right now. And I'm getting multi-strikes galore. But yeah, you just do this, build three. You can also do an AoE. That's the AoE. And notice I have this little flash of light, which is instant now, self-healing. Or you could heal somebody else. Um, they're all, they're really solid single target characters right now. I have a heal somewhere that I'm just, right here. Three holy power gives you a big heal. Bop, yay. Um, oh, some other things they bring in all classes are seals. Not seals. Seals, yes, but that's different. That's individual. Um, blessings. Like this one we have hand of protection. Um, there's several others, like here's Hand of Sacrifice. You can put this on somebody, they take less damage, but it transfers it to your Paladin. Um, what else? Hand of Protection. <coughs> you can put this on somebody if they're taking physical damage. They're immune to all physical damage, but they're unable to act as well. Hand of Freedom. You put that puppy on somebody like this, and they can't be slowed or rooted. It's actually very nice. So a lot of utility. Uh, most of it's selfish, in my personal opinion, but, you know, I'm a selfish person, I guess. I don't know. So... There you go. It's all pretty cool. Um, oh, and speaking of utility, you can take this talent right here, and all of your hand abilities, which are those blessings I was telling you about, have two charges, so you can actually help out more than one person. Or just really help yourself out a lot. And that's pretty much the Paladin. Melee, <coughs> single target strength, some AoE, depending on other things, you can have solid AoE, and healer. So that that's his hybridness right there. Oh, and, you know...